American commanders illegally in my country without papers? <laughs> this will be an international incident. What do you mean, international incident? We heard that you had great potato soup. We wanted to get some before it was all gone. You're making very funny jokes. Now, let me tell you your options. Please. You will sign confession stating that you're a guerrilla force illegally airlifted into my country. You will admit to crimes against my government, and you will appear before the national press substantiating these charges. If you refuse to do so, you will be shot immediately. Well, we get a trial, don't we? Now, let me lay it out for you, fellow. We're not signing any confessions. We're not representatives of the U.S. government. As a matter of fact, we're fugitives in the United States, so you're going to have a little trouble making your fantasy stick when you choose to die. But, but, but what about that trial? I find you guilty. You will be shot within an hour. Justice is a little swift around here, isn't it? Martin, prepare a firing squad. What are we going to do? We're going to have to freelance some kind of plan. What? Well, that's usually a Hannibal's end of the stick, but that chopper has got to be the only way out of here. Forget about the chopper. We haven't got a pilot. Don't matter. I'll walk before I fly. Hannibal, look. It's a bunch of gasoline drums next to our ammo dump. That's what it is. Now, that wasn't very bright, was it? You think we could puncture a hole in one of them and leak a little? Maybe. Come on. Uh, now, we've only got an hour because Rasham's putting us in front of a firing squad. But I've got a plan. Now, if it's going to work, I have to get shot first. Get up. What are you going to do? What the Pentagon's paying us for. Be creative. I say, get up. It'll do. You ready to confess? I already gave you my answer. We're Americans. We've got nothing to confess. Then you're ready to die. Well, nobody's ever really ready, but it kind of comes with the territory. Let's go. You. Uh, me? Hey, listen, dirtball. I'm in command here. And in keeping with military tradition, I get to go first. Take him away. Your turn. You will come later. Mm, wait, 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 guys. Let's talk about this. I'm not really with these guys. Get going, B.A. Here, you take this. When I throw one of these smoke flares, you run like a rabbit and don't look back. Sir. Look, I tell you, you got the wrong guy. Place him on his mark. You know, that other fellow, he loves that kind of thing. I... 
Yeah, you're gonna hear from my senator about this. Okay. Oh, wait, wait a minute. You, uh, no, no last cigarette? Huh? Oh, come on. Uh, just a cigarette. Give him a cigarette. <sighs> Thanks. Ah, oh, my brand. Oh, it's good. You know, you checked the Geneva Convention, and uh, I'll bet there's all kinds of stuff we're missing here, you know? And, uh, what about a special meal for the condemned man? I didn't get that. No, I mean, uh, I no last request, not a one. Okay, B.A., get their attention. Hey, man! Hey, you! you can't do this! I'm gonna make you pay! You can't get away with this here! Proceed. Prepare to fire! Take him! to fly. Oh, oh. Didn't know you had it in, General. I've been waiting a long time for that. 